All right, guys, I'm going to show you the morning ladies hungry, clustered before breakfast. Majority of them are right up front here, telling me they're hungry. A couple back there. My skittish ones. Goodness, ladies. This is their loudest part of the day, I think. Are you hungry? Huh? Take that as a yes. Yeah, you hungry? Say their food bowl is almost empty, so they still got some calcium and some grit. Their water is still full up towards the top. But, woo, they are hungry gals today. I'm going to feed them some squash from the garden, and then I'm going to get their uh, nutrients and stuff ready to go. Get them some corn today, because you notice how big they are. They definitely. Uh, they eat whatever I have available, whether it's food scraps or what's gotten too big out of the garden that uh, I don't really like to eat. So they get all the extra garden scraps. Yeah, don't ya? Goodness. Alright, so I'm going to go get them some food. There's my Easter egg here, by the way. Got my New Hampshire Reds. Right there, got a couple of them. Got my Buff Orpington. My beautiful Buff Orpington is right here. She is gorgeous. Just gorgeous. The rest of them are barred rocks. So, I think in this coming week or two, I'll be getting rid of... Uh, I'll be banding the ones I want to keep for breeding. And I will be giving away uh, the rest to a farm where they can free range for the rest of their wonderful lives. So, however long that may be. Uh, chickens can live up to 15, 16 years, so they're almost two. So they got quite a long life if no one butchers them left to live. There's one of my broody hens coming out right here, running up for a drink of water. She thinks she's sitting on some eggs, gonna hatch some babies. So, little baby chicks. That's about a 21-day cycle for baby chicks to be born, so. She comes out every now and again just to get a drink and a little sip of water up there. So you're getting a little drink out of the trough. So, she must be thirsty. Alright, well, happy summer everybody. Have a great day.